March uh, 23rd, 2017. This is just an experiment. I've got some red potatoes <clears throat> that are uh, well sprouting. And what I've done is just stuffed them in here in this water bath. And I want to see what they do. Uh, they might, might just die. But uh, who knows, they might uh, kind of go like sweet potatoes. Okay, it is March 30th, and I uh, just thought I'd now have another look at these potatoes. That's how they're looking right now. So how about this one? One thing I noticed, and let me try to show this, is right around the top, do you see there's some roots uh, forming? And uh, I don't know if the potatoes... I will have to let them go and see. I think there's some new, new uh, green that's coming, but... Uh, We'll see. It is the 6th of April, and let me show you what's happening to these potatoes. It looks to me like, you know, the leaves are certainly greening up, as you can see here. Uh, and this one, uh, well, I don't know, there's don't see so many leaves as you do these uh, stems or whatever they are fattening up. But look underneath here, what's happening. You see that there are roots growing on both of these. I didn't want to pull this one out because it wrecks the roots. But you can see on this one, on this side, there are roots coming down. And, uh, I mean, it, it looks healthy. I think there's some kind of a mung on the bottom here. I don't know what that is. But I'm going to keep these going for a while and see what they do. I think this is kind of interesting. Let's see there. Yeah, you can see them right there. See the roots going down. This one's a little bit tighter in the. This one's tighter in the hole. That's why I don't. Well, bother with it. But yeah, look at that. See the roots coming down. But let's see if I can get those back in there. But it's interesting. The roots seem to be coming along the base of this, and not out of the potato anywhere else. But, well, I pulled that out of the hole. I hope those roots could find their way back in. It's like I say, those. Uh, this one's a little fatter in the hole than this one is, so you can see this one here is doing the same thing. See the roots? Interesting. So I'm going to put these potatoes over here. There, right here. Okay. And so now what will happen? is as the uh, as the water comes up these this platform will float a little bit and as the water uh, basic starts going down see you can see it's going well I didn't show you here but it was up covering this a few minutes ago but uh, as it goes down the roots will be exposed and I'm hoping that it will emulate the conditions in the uh, spray ponics, that's not the right name, there's a word for it, but in, in the root spraying system where the potatoes will grow, then it'll kind of emulate that and maybe maybe this will work. So we're going to try it. Talking about the hydroponic or uh, aquaponic potatoes, let me show you something here. You see how they're doing. Again, it's 22nd of, of uh, April. Now look at this. You see what's happening. These, uh, there are some shoots coming off. See the green shoots there? And I think what happens is, those are where potatoes will start to form, I think. So we'll see what happens. Now notice here from the last time, how many more roots we have here. Look how, uh, Remember there was just a couple of roots dangling down from this one. And this one did have quite a few roots, but look at that. We're getting shoots down here and all kinds of things. This is really taking off, so who knows? We might actually get some potatoes. I found that, you know, I think that uh, potatoes like to grow in the dark. So what I'm doing is I'm shielding this, uh, this, this platform here from... The sunshine, the sun's coming up from that way, that's why there's a gap there, because anyway, the, the point being is that I'm going to try to shield the sunshine from underneath this all that I can, and see if that helps uh, 
spawn the potatoes, but they seem to be growing. And let me show you how the hydroponic potatoes are doing. Here, let me shift the camera around. Alright, they're right there. Okay. Now, like I said, I put these things on here to try to keep the light out from where the water is. But look at this. Let me just lift this up and uh, see what we've got here. I hope you can see that, but we've got a lot of roots coming and we've got, it looks to me like potatoes are going to start growing here. There's one right there. Well, I'm not sure if that's a pack of leaves or whatever, but it's definitely growing and it's doing well. Now, here's well, it's the uh, 3rd of May today, and I thought I'd uh, give you a little update on how these uh, potatoes are growing. I'm going to show you first right here. This is how things are growing from the top. Yeah, the, the, there are leaves here coming up. See, this, these are doing quite quite nice, I guess. This one over here, remember, had look, all of it looked like that with little nubs. But see, there's leaves sprouting out on that one. So let's look at the bottom here. Now, take a look at that. I hope that's focusing. But see, these, uh, these shoots are coming down, and I think potatoes are forming on them. Let me turn this over here where you can see it. Now here's one. And you see there's it's getting bulbous here at the bottom. And there's another one right up there. I don't know if you can see that, but right up there you can see a little red thing. So I think potatoes are forming. And uh, then look what's happening to this. See the if you can see inside there. The skin is still there, but the potato, the meat inside the potato is starting to disappear. Now, if you look at this one here, take a closer look at that one. You know, the same kinds of things are happening, although not as not as uh, advanced. But uh, the roots are coming down, and it is it is uh, surviving quite well. Anyway, that's what's happening so far. See that? So we'll put this back in. We shall let it uh, let it run a little longer and see what happens. Well, good morning. It is uh, May the eighth, twenty seventeen, and I thought I'd do a little update on these uh, aquaponic, hydroponic potatoes and show you how they're growing. It's I, this is quite informative. I didn't know they would do this, but. First of all, let me show you the top here. Now, uh, look on the top here. You can see the, the, uh, you know, the it's growing. The the foliage is growing, and certainly this one has got a difference. But now, look here. You can see right there, right there. If you look at that carefully, it looks like a potato maybe tried to start growing there, but then you know, it, because I guess it's out in the sun, it turned into a uh, stem, and I guess uh, I, I don't know how else to explain it, but it's just odd. But anyway, let me get a little better angle of that. But you can kind of see that now. Now this one here, you can see it's it didn't have much foliage before, but it's uh, doing quite well. Now let me pull the bottom up here, and you'll see what's on the bottom. And I think you'll see that is quite interesting. Now look. Pull it up. Look at that. Now you can see there are definitely potatoes growing on the ends of those little shoots. Now what's interesting is there seem to be growing on this side, but not on this side. And I'm wondering because this side is where I haven't been shading it. Maybe there's some sunlight getting in here and getting under there. Maybe that's the key. And if you look inside here, you can see that it is sucking up the potato as nutrition, I guess. But there are definitely uh, real potatoes growing, and they're all nice and round. 
And under here, see there's some leaves coming out of that one. But the other one's not yet, maybe they're too small. But they're all, oh, there's some right there on that side. You can see right there. See right there, they're growing. But that's what they're doing. Now if you look at this one here, uh, there's really no potatoes that I can see growing yet. But there's a, a stem coming down. So maybe it'll do that. But anyway, uh, so this is how it's happening. I, I, I think this is quite interesting. Anyway, so there it is. I thought you might be interested. We'll give you another update later. Wouldn't that be interesting if off of this you can really get a decent potato harvest? That would be kind of interesting.